Oh, Charlie, the TV is broken again. The owls are back. They're scaring me. Ha <laughs> ha, imagine being afraid of owls. Couldn't be me. What a loser. <laughs> Did you all miss me? Oh, admit it. You totally missed me. I didn't miss you, sir. Well, I don't care because your opinion doesn't matter. I didn't miss you either. You take that black. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? Tomoda Sauce here. In my last video, uh, uh TV. I meant the video before that. Cheese is just a loaf of milk. Okay, the video before both of those. Yes, okay, there we go. In that video, I told you guys more about the upcoming series on the channel, Has Been Hotel Abridged, which I am very excited to begin, and I know you guys are all excited for, but one question still remains. Now that I can share the news, I can finally give you guys the answer you've been waiting for. Where did the Owl House Abridged go? Trust me, I'm fully aware that Has Been Hotel content has been filling up the channel recently. And yes, part of it is just because it's one of my new favorite shows. And of course, I'm warming up for Has Been Abridged, but it's been a while since the last episode of Owl House. Like, where did it go? Did Tomoda just decide to stop? Like, where did it disappear to? Well, I got good news and I got bad news. Oh, sweet. Bad news. I love that. With all due respect, my lord, shut up. So the good news is, yes, the series is still going. I have a ton of plans for it, and I'm really excited to keep dubbing episodes. Has been and Owl House Abridged will be going at the same time. In fact, another episode of the Owl House Abridged should be the next video posted, so that's good. But why was it on hiatus for so long? And that's where we get to the bad news. The next episode of the Owl House Abridged will sadly be the final episode that Zelda voices Lilith. As for why, well, life just hits you like a truck sometimes. And it's always the smart decision to put yourself and your own important responsibilities first. But with that being said, can we take a moment to look at how freaking legendary Zelda was? I mean, Let's just rewind back to when I was gonna dub the season one finale episode. Here's a fun fact for you viewers that were not there then. Because I think this was like two years ago and oh my god, really? It's been that long? I realized I had to hold some auditions to find a voice for Lilith. And I actually ended up casting somebody and releasing the trailer and it wasn't Zelda. We were gonna start dubbing it that way and then I was approached by some people and they told me some things. And I was like, oh god. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but Twitter did something good. Or at least the people on it by helping me realize that the person I had casted was actually awful. And no, I don't mean their acting ability, I mean they were genuinely a horrible, creepy person. So you know, I deleted the trailer and booted her off the cast as quick as possible. Like you do. But then I'm sitting there like, oh, great, it was hard enough to find somebody the first round of auditions, how am I gonna find somebody to voice Lilith now? And as if I summoned her, Zelda showed up and burst through the window of my audition forms and was like, hey! And the rest is history, that's how we met. To this day, I still find that string of events just unbelievable, but I'm so happy that I was able to meet her. And you guys know the talent that she brought to the table. I mean, she was killing it in these episodes. Yeah, I see you finally got my message that I, uh, kidnapped your pupil. Oh, that was a bad choice of words. <laughs> it's not happening, Ida! Why do humans have such weak stomach- Oh my god. This could all stop if you just join the coven, Ida! I'm not doing that weirdo bidding! What's wrong with my bidding? I'm stronger than you! You are not! Am too! Am not! Am too! Am not! Then prove it! My curse on you was proof enough! Say what? Say what? Say what? And then not too long after that, she actually helped talk me into going to the Owl House Gallery Nucleus event, and it was amazing. Zelda is genuinely one of the sweetest people that I have met in this community so far, and having her as Lilith on the cast has been a dream come true. Zelda, you helped make the Owl House abridged into what it is today, and I can never thank you enough for that. We're all super sad to see you go, but I'm so happy that you were able to choose a final episode, and you were able to record a little message for everybody, which I'll play for you all right now. I am so upset to be having to leave this because, you know, not only am I an Owl House fan myself, but I just know how much the Owl House dubs, like, Tomoda's dubs have meant to this fandom, and it's been so crazy and so insane to see people, like, coming up to me and approaching me saying that they know me as Lilith from this dub, and Lilith is just such an important character to me. She's the whole reason why I started watching the show, and I am just very appreciative that I even got to do this in the first place, so I just want to thank you guys for being absolutely awesome, and of course a big shout out to Tomoda for being the best ever. Thank you, and this video is in your honor for everything that you've done for the channel, and everything that you will go on to do in the future, because you've done so many amazing things already, and I cannot wait to see what you do next. Please keep me posted. So next up on the channel is Zelda's final dub for the Owl House of Bridge. And hey, voice actors are kind 
content creators alike, auditions are about to begin for Has Been Hotel Abridged, so be sure to keep your eyes peeled. Thanks again for everything Zelda, and we'll see you in the next episode. Tomoda Sauce, out!